The date was the 26th of April 2017. And on this day, I started a journey that would change my perspectives on the world forever. This journey would take me to three different countries in just five days. And the first place that beckoned was Rome, the capital of Italy. To get to Italy though, I had to take the first flight of the day out from London Stansted Airport, arriving at Rome's Ciampino Airport in the mid-morning. After a coach ride to the centre of Rome, our group checked into the hostel to drop off our suitcases, as well as to admire the view of Rome through the hostel's window. Despite arriving into Rome's city centre late in the day, we managed to still get a fair bit done on our first day in Rome. We walked around the neighbourhood, taking into account the numerous Roman ruins that seemed to lie everywhere. After a tram ride, we visited an obelisk that bore the name of former Il Duce Benito Mussolini that is now located outside of a sports stadium. This was a crucial piece of evidence for our A-level history course, which was the whole purpose of the European trip. However, we could not come to Rome without also doing some sightseeing. The thing about Rome is that it is a very densely packed city, so despite being very different tourist attractions, we managed to see the Spanish Steps, the Trevi Fountain and the Pantheon all within a short walk of each other. Furthermore, after a visit to a traditional Italian pizzeria where I proceeded to devour a rather pricey pizza, we even got to see the Colosseum at night, which pretty much concludes day one of visiting Rome. <laughs> Thank you.